almost ready to start writing a resume. However, before you actually start crafting that fantastic resume, you really need to know three things. First of all, you need to know what you want. I don't mean I want a job. Of course you want a job. I mean, what are five job titles that are probably going to give you what you want? What are some companies and industries where you might find that? So hopefully you already know that and can just pull out that piece of paper where you wrote all of that down. Uh, if not, you need to go do some work. So number one, you need to know clearly and concisely what's the job that you're going for. Number two, you need to know what employers want. So if those are the jobs that you want, what are employers asking for in terms of skills and experience? Number three, you need to know what makes you great. Yes, you have got some unique talents. You've done some great things. Doesn't matter what jobs you've had in the past. There's something about you that's special. And you need to capture that and turn it into a story that you can put on your resume to highlight why you have the skills and expertise for the job that you want. Okay, so you know what you want and you've got a list of target job titles and hopefully some companies and industries where you're likely to go and, and find those jobs. Know what employers want. Have you already made a list of the desired and required skills? If you haven't, take out a clean piece of paper or do this on your computer, however you prefer, and I want you to create three columns. In the first column, I want you to write required and desired skills at the top. The second column, yes or no. Do I have the skills or not? And the third column, if I've got it, if the answer is yes, I do have that skill, you're going to need to write that down. If not, we'll talk about what to do there. So three columns, what are employers requiring and what are they really, what are the nice to have skills? Second column, do I have the skills, yes or no? And the third column, what skills do I have that compare to what they're looking for? All right, now how are you going to get at all of that? I'm going to do a little market research. Take those five job titles that you want and go do a Google search or do a search on indeed.com and look for job postings that appeal to you. Print them out. I'm not trying to waste paper here. I've just discovered that this is the most effective way for people to actually do this market research. So print out those five or 10 job postings and take a highlighter and actually highlight what are the skills that are required and desired for jobs that I think I'd like to get. Once you've done that, you're going to start to see some patterns and employers are looking for similar things, but they might call them something different. So if you need to, write down everything to begin with. And then what I want to do, what I want you to do is I want you to whittle that list down to the top 10 required skills. What are the top 10 things that employers are asking for with jobs that I'm interested in? You're going to put those in that first column on that piece of paper. And once you've done that, you're going to go through them one by one. If you want a job as a waiter at an upscale restaurant, for example, probably the first thing employers want is a minimum of three or five years of experience. Which is it? Is it three? Is it five? Write that down. Do you have that? Yes or no? If you do, great. Write down how many years of experience you have. If you don't, write no in the middle column and then write down how many years of experience you do have. Do you think you need to go get more years of experience before you apply for a job? Well, we don't know yet. We need to go through the rest of the skills and see if you've got everything else they're looking for. And that's going to help you determine, is this a real or just a perceived gap? And this is all going to help you write a resume. It's going to get you the job that you want. So along the way, we're figuring out, is this an issue? Is my list of jobs that I want correct or not? Mm -hmm.